U.S. issues the first X passport. This marks an important step in recognizing the rights of persons who do not identify as either male or female. The State Department said Wednesday that it hopes to be ready to give the option to a wider range of people next year. Intersex activist Dana Ziem from Fort Collins, Colorado told that they got the passport, but the agency refused to name the recipient. With respect to a passport, Ziem, who likes to use gender-neutral pronouns, has been fighting the State Department since 2015 in an effort to avoid having to lie about his, her gender by selecting either male or female. Their lawyer, Paul Castillo of Lambda Legal, texted and phoned Ziem early the next morning to let him know the passport package had come. Ziem, pronounced Zim, went to pick it up. Ziem and two other activists had remained up late the night before to mark Intersex Awareness Day. While Ziem, 63, said it was exciting to finally acquire the passport, the objective was to assist the next generation of intersex individuals get recognized as complete citizens with rights, Ziem said.